The Southwest Arts Group is bringing master teachers from schools like Juilliard, the Johns Hopkins Peabody Conservatory of Music, and well-known opera singers to the African American Performing Arts Center. They're providing training to aspiring vocal artists, artists of all kind, and best of all, no fee for their classes. So joining us now with more this morning on the classes, Tony Zancanella, the Executive Director of Opera Southwest. Good to have you, Tony. And Renato Estacio, President and Artistic Director of the Southwest Arts Group. Gentlemen, good to, good to have you here. Let's talk about these classes, first of all, in, in a second, but first of all, the Resident Arts Program. What is that? How does it apply to the community? Uh, the Resident Arts Program is a way for young and aspiring uh, emerging artists uh, mm -hmm. who are primarily opera and, and voice artists to come and get trained and, and have experience. And again, this is for the community, right? Mm -hmm. This is a night, this is to draw people in and, and really celebrate the arts, correct? In what way? Um, well, right now, what we have is um, a residency with the African American Performing Arts Center, right? Mm -hmm. And so what that does is it allows people to go and just explore their art, um, find a way to 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 sing and, and express themselves. And so these opportunities aren't always available unless you leave the city or mm -hmm. you go to uh, some kind of summer program or so this is what it's for. And what inspired you to bring those opportunities then into Albuquerque? Oh, this is this one's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, I had a, a casino um, gig basically all yeah. last year, right? And so I, I, when I moved here, I, I took that and I said, you know, why not start a, a, an artist program? Because mm -hmm. it was just me and I was just going to go sing by myself. And I said, no. So I started recruiting singers and helping them um, become young artists. And that's, is this all about just vocalists or are there other opportunities? There's other opportunities, um, acting, dancing, so art exhibition. Who's teaching? Who's, who actually comes in to instruct? Well, Renato has got a, a fabulous slate of teachers from a <laughs> lot of, I, I think, yeah. really interesting and prestigious institutions, Juilliard, Peabody. One of the things um, we at Opera Southwest are really excited uh, mm -hmm. to see Renato uh, doing with the Southwest Arts Group is creating um, uh, performance and residency opportunities for uh, New Mexico artists, uh, our uh, artists come from a national pool, our upcoming La Boheme, uh, March 22nd to the 29th, mm -hmm. there are still tickets. Um, <laughs> I'm sure know, that's a wonderful opportunity too. To yeah, see yeah. Is, is primarily um, uh, staffed by professional singers from around the country. Um, and what we like about what Renato is doing is it's creating uh, performance opportunities again for New Mexico artists to get uh, some serious training and... Uh, yeah. And that training, um, like you said, uh, from Juilliard, we'll, we'll have Cynthia Hoffman. Mm -hmm. um, from Peabody Conservatory, we have Phyllis Brynn Jolson. From um, uh, the Soul Train Music Awards, mm -hmm. uh, one of the gals that sang there last is Allison Cambridge. She was the first opera singer to ever perform on the Soul Train Music Awards. And we also have Lillian Roberts, who uh, was a resident artist at the Academy of Vocal Arts. Tony, I'm curious, so. with, with these kind of opportunities locally, is that gonna mean a better pool of candidates maybe for you, or what does that do, do you think, promote arts in the community? Well, we certainly hope so. That's, yeah. again, like I said, that's one of the things uh, we would like to see come out of uh, mm -hmm. Renato's program and uh, with Southwest Arts Group is, um, you know, a stronger and larger pool of New Mexico artists that uh, we can tap for uh, productions at, uh, uh, for us, in our case, the National Hispanic Cultural sure. Center. So. Mm -hmm. All right, Renato, give me details on where we can get more information if we're interested at home. So uh, you can go to the website, which is www.nmswag.com, the Mexico Southwest Arts Group. Okay. And on there, we'll have audition information. We'll start to release more information as the time gets closer. It's fascinating. Well, good luck to you. Best of luck. It sounds like a great program. Renato and Tony, thank you so much for being here this morning and discussing all this with us. And we'll keep posted on this. We're interested to find out how it turns out. We'll be right back, folks. Don't go anywhere.